Pandas. Pandas. Pandas, 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 pandas. I got broads in Atlanta. Just in Dublin in the Fanta. Just in Dublin in the Fanta. Credit cards and the scammers. Pandas, welcome back. Welcome back to the stream. Thanks for joining, everyone. I'm back. Guess who's back? Sorry for the little mix mix up. I, I know I had a stream set up scheduled yesterday, but um, yeah, it was my bad. <laughs> well, we are back today. And we are streaming. We are live, ready to go. Pandas, 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 pandas. Thanks for joining, everyone. Thanks for joining. Let me just say this, pandas. Let me just quickly say this. What in the world was this about? This happened overnight session. If I measure it, let's just say from the top to the bottom, we have a, is that the top? It's not even the top. We have an 88 point move overnight pandas. I mean, that is actually insane. That is actually crazy pandas. Can you believe it? But what's even crazier is this. We are right back where we started. <laughs> After an 88 point move, 88 point drop, we are right back where we started, Pandas. Unbelievable. Actually unbelievable. So many spikes and channels. Expanding pattern here actually is annoying. I hate expanding patterns. Okay, we broke this trend. <clears throat> now we're pretty much back to where we began, which is a previous day's close. I almost feel like we just reset and we just kind of pretend nothing happened overnight. And uh, <laughs> really uh, just, uh, yeah, let's just pretend nothing happened. Yeah, I believe there was news about Israel. Um, I don't know if there's any more details other than they like attacked Iran. I don't even know, I don't even know the... Um, what was the uh, damage that Iran caused? I just I just saw like posts of Israel's like missile defense, and that's all I saw. Bandus, 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 bandus. We're live, streaming every single day. TGIF Pandas, they got it's Friday. Friday, Friday, Friday. Finally get to rest a little bit after this crazy week of trading. Big push down, spike in channel again. Hope you guys are doing well. Jeffrey Hall, welcome. Lee, welcome. Lou, welcome. Pond, welcome. Blacklight, welcome. <laughs> Charles Wilson, good morning. Hans, good morning. Do you know who would be the best drone pilots? Just get all the gamers 
who play like Rocket League or something. Get all the gamers who like who just have crazy, um, I don't know what you call it, mouse and keyboard eye coordination, <laughs> whatever that is. Just get all the best gamers in the world, <clears throat> pay them a bunch of money, and they'll be the best drone pilots ever. They're basically gamifying, gamifying uh, war at this point. It's a bunch of drones flying around. They would be the best drone pilots. Hans McMorning somewhere in Rockies. Good morning. Eating my breakfast real quick. Just scrambled, just scrambled eggs and toast with butter, salted butter of course, and um, freshly squeezed orange juice. Not that anyone asks, but I don't care. You're gonna, you guys are gonna know what what, I, what Panda's eating today. All right, pandas. J S S M S S. Welcome to the stream. Take good morning. Hey, pandas. Make sure you scop that like button. Make sure you got GMs in the chat. Really? Yours truly needs. Yours truly needs those thoughts and prayers. We're about to open here. Jeff, good morning. Welcome, welcome. We are about to get started in about two and a half minutes, pandas. 
We crash and burn, bounce all the way back up. Is today just gonna be a crazy day? I don't know. Quick news check. I'm pretty sure we have no news today. No news today. <clears throat> Other than the tax. Let's take a look at news in the next couple weeks here. On Tuesday, we got Flash Services PMI. We'll be trading. We'll be streaming by then. Um, next week, the big news is Friday. Definitely. By the way, if you want to know what I believe will be news big enough, like basically I call them make or break news events. And um, I categorize them as news events that you can literally trade your evals in one single trade. And either you bust your evals or you pass your evals. And um, I mark all, I mark what I believe will be those news events, right? Those news events that would be big, big, big enough to cause that volatility. And uh, I post them on the Discord. If you want to know what those news events are, jump on the Discord. And you'll see the channel where I mark all the news events that I believe will be big enough to make or break any evals. Definitely the 50k evals, right? 50k e or well, like it's a 25k evals, the easiest to pass. The 300k evals are actually pretty difficult. You need like a 12 point move without having like a five point drawdown. It's kind of crazy. The reason why Apex is so powerful, honestly, is because of the trade copier. The fact they allow you to open 20 accounts, pandas, it's crazy. We're only having four accounts and we're trying to make 100K with just four accounts, pandas. 30 more seconds to market opens, pandas. We'll get a countdown soon. Starting, or starting at the, the 10 second countdown, we'll, we'll count down. Ten, nine, eight seven six five four three two one ding 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 markets open a little too early for a trap here even though it looks good for a trap Ooh, it looks good for a trap right we're above the 20 may Interesting here. Getting sideways. Ooh. Inside bar. Pushing to the downside a little bit. Hmm. Usually you want a double bottom of some sort. Maybe this was a double bottom here. You got a trap about a trigger. It didn't trigger yet though, Pandas. <clears throat> hasn't triggered yet, but it's about to. Gilbert Medina with the 20 gifted. Are there even 20 people watching? <laughs> Gilbert Medina. Medina's back. 20 gifted. Medina, you gotta let us know what happened. Usually that means he got a big payout. Goodness gracious, it just bombards my chat. It bombards my screen. 20 gifted subs. The MVP. Good morning, pandas and panda warriors. Or good morning, BBM and panda warriors. I stole a 7.3k bag of Nats Crack Bamboo on a short last night, heading to the beach with my Mrs. Panda. Enjoy the memberships and have a great weekend. Much panda love to everyone. Pandas. Let's go. 7.3k? Bag of Nats Crack? That NASCAR, I can't get enough of it. I appreciate it. Hope you enjoy your time at the beach. I mean, pandas. When I say I have the best community on YouTube verified, it's not even an exaggeration. It's not a hyperbole. It is just fact. It is just fact. He's that panda. He's that panda. He is the guy. He is the panda. You guys are all pandas now. 
<laughs> you guys can jump on the uh, pre-market show and see how much money we're making on this uh, on this journey here. He is that guy. He is that guy. Trust me, you're not that guy. Well, he is that guy. I think a trap trade here. Forget it. The question is, will we get a trap at all? <laughs> There's probably about 20 people watching, actually. And Hugh, somewhere in the Rockies, are wondering, why, why aren't we pandas yet? I'll take a trap here, double bottom. Close enough for me. It's just bombarding the screen, pandas. It's almost over. It's almost over. We're in. The one to one. I mean, you're obviously looking for a new high. Let's get that new high pandas. The dentist trader. I hope you're not trading while you're doing surgery or doing a an operation or whatever you whatever dentists call their procedures. Good morning guys, good morning. This trap looks like it's about to fail here. I thought we had a double bottom reversal. We had a trap set up, beautifully set up for us. The traps will trap. Okay, pushing down. This failed trap could be a reversal back down. Oof. Okay, just got hit. At least we didn't get slippage. I can be happy with that. We didn't get slippage today. I'll take it. I was looking for a double bottom. And then uh, we had a trap reversal here. It's all good. Moving on. Next trade. I thought the risk reward was worth it for um, for the possible new high here. We got a four point risk, but we could have made like eight points. So I thought the probability was good enough for me there, but you know, it is what it is. Get hit, move on. A, B, C, D, one, two, three, four. That's like a password, like capital A. B, C, D, one, two, three, four. That's like a password that you'll use. I hope that's not your password, A, B, C, D. I think he trades dentists. That makes a lot more sense. Like he, he finds dentists and he trades them for money. I get it. It makes sense. Thanks for joining. Hope you enjoy me losing some money here. That's a four point loss. It's all good, pandas. Hey, we move on. We, we recovered from worse, far worse. Man, but that gifted 20. Pandas. Whoever shorted yesterday is a genius though, I'll tell you that much. Whoever shorted yesterday is a genius. Getting a big move back down here. Not, I wasn't expecting that, but we're in trading range now. Um, it is what it is. What can you do? I was relying on the double bottom here, right? A higher low double bottom. It happens sometimes. I could have been a little more patient, actually, wait for a new low before looking for a move back up. Now we got three hits down here. It's starting to look a little like an expanding pattern about to develop here. Big move up, big move down.
undershoot to an overshoot. Double bottom. I thought that would be a decent reversal. Okay. <clears throat> Possible inside bar developing on the five minute chart. Ooh, okay. 10K chart. Bouncing off the 20 EMA like perfectly. Hmm. Okay. I can see that. I can see that being a thing. It'd be hard to take, right? Because it's big risk. But maybe with a deep enough pullback, consider it. 10,000 tick trap. OI pattern, maybe on the five minute. <clears throat> It looks a bit choppy. It looks like trading range. It's a little difficult to trade. Ten thousand tick trap. He trades Colgate stock only, exclusively. The dentist trader. It's such an interesting name. Is it interesting? I don't know. Maybe it's not that interesting. Maybe I'm looking too much into it. What is going on here, pandas? What is that actually going on? 10,000 tick, maybe 20 MA here. Mm, give me decent push up, it's just a pretty big risk and uh, uncertain. Right, it's basically a triangle currently forming here. Inside bar on the five minute chart. I don't know. Maybe I'll consider to go long on the inside bar on the five minute. Maybe. To play the trading range on the five minute chart. Second entry short here. Okay. It makes sense to get another push down, right? Because you got one push down, another push down. That's what you're looking for. Bottom of trading range as well. Hmm. The only problem for me is a 10,000 tick is above the 20 MA. That's probably the biggest concern for me to take this short. And also this trend line here. Trap may trigger. I don't know, Banis. That's tricky. You got a second just short. It looks like it needs another leg down. But a trap triggers instead. And what is going on now, Pandas? I have no idea. This is tough, pandas. It does look like it's going sideways. We got a possible OII pattern on the five minute chart, which is just wild. Okay. 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 Five minute, the inside OI pattern breaks to the upside, can come back to the top of the trading range easily. Good double bottom here. See, that's wild right there, right? Because when you get a push down like this, when you see a push down like this, you're thinking one more leg down instead of traps. Jeez. This is tough. I don't know. I'm still uncertain what's going to happen here, Panos. Hmm. Okay. 
right? Strong bull bar, any other side, no follow through, and then buy the close. Very interesting. Huh. Okay, now another strong bull bar ending on its high. Very interesting. What to do here, pandas? What am I looking for? Am I looking for a long trade, a short trade? It's confusing to me. I guess I'm looking for a long trade now, but. Okay. Avalon, late star, did I miss any good price action? Yeah, you missed this amazing um, trade here that you could have lost $200. You missed out on that, so that just sucks for you. I, on their hand, got that up to the opportunity to lose that money, so that's how lucky we are right now. All right, pandas, what's going on here? Are we trying to push up? What, what's happening here? 10,000 tick, right? Just bounce off the 20 May strong bull bar. Follow through. Most likely here. Right? You got two bull bars in a row above the 20 May. Just ramping off of it. Huh. I should just buy long. I should just go long. I should just go long. Just go long anywhere. I should just do it. I'm going to do it, pandas. I'm going to go long. Watch. Just watch. Five minute chart. I'm going long. Get ready. Strong bull bar. I'm gonna go long on the strong bull bar. Just watch, Panas. You wait and see. You just wait and see. I'll do it. You don't think I'll do it? I'll do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna buy the clothes here. Just watch. Watch this bravery. Act of bravery here. Worst trade of my life. Why did I enter there? What am I doing, Pandas? Why did I just enter there? Your risk is this far. Pandas, what am I doing with my life? What am I doing with my life right now? Just strong bull bar. I, I try to buy the clothes, but I ended up buying one tick above the clothes. It's all good, pandas. That's all good. The max risk I'm willing to take is five points. One, two, three, four, five. Mass, mass, max risk here for me. One, two, three, four, five. Five to five. One to one. I'll take the one to one here. You didn't think I'll do it, but I did it. You didn't think I had the cojones just to go long off the strong bull bar. Point to the top of the trading range. You don't you didn't think I had the cojones, but I do. And I did. What in the world? Don't tell me you don't tell me you tickle me like that. Pandas, don't tell me you're tickling me like that. No. No. Don't tell me you're gonna tickle me. Don't tell me you're gonna tickle my tick. Tickling my tick, it just tapped my tick. Pandas, don't tell me you're gonna tickle me, tickle my tick like that. <gasps> Pandas. Pandas. P pandas, don't tell me you're gonna tickle my tick. No! I feel like I gotta protect myself now. I feel like I gotta protect myself. It comes all the way down here. I don't wanna. I don't wanna stay around. See what happens. I don't wanna mess around. It tickled my tick, pandas. It tickled my tick. It just tickled my tick. Pandas, it tickled my tick. What in the world? Ah, uh, pandas. It tickled my tick. I, I don't think... I pandas. Pandas? Please don't... Do not dare. Do not dare take me out break even. Do not dare do it. 
No! Pandas! It tickled my tick and came out break even. Woo! The market just tickled my tick. What in the world was that, pandas? It literally shot up to my target and then just tickled it and came back down. It just tickled the under my underbelly. Just to leave me hanging. What a tease. But I come out break even. I think that's a smart thing to do here. I come out break even. It is what it is. Goodness gracious, pandas. It's like Jerome Powell knew. I wanted five points there. Tickles my tick and then reverses on me. Pandas! Pandas, why? Why? Ah! I'm not tilted. I'm not angry. Pandas, I'm not angry. What makes you think I'm angry? Nothing that has happened to make me angry. Just, just be happy, pandas. Be glad we have breath in our lungs. Be glad that we're awake today. Be, be glad that we have our lives. All right, pandas. Just be happy with the, the simple things in life. Don't think about getting your, your tick tickled. What in the world was that, pandas? That's just, that's just rude. That's just rude. That is just rude. It makes that new high, right? Breaks this pivot high. And then, um, kind of reversing now. <clears throat> Let's see what happens. I'll take a trap trade. I'll do it. I'll do it. Tickling my tick and you trap out afterwards. I'll do it. I'll do it. Tickled my tick. Pretty strong push down. I'm glad I came out break even there. Really glad I came out break even. I'm really glad I came out break even. Goodness gracious, what's happening? Right, we got an overshoot here. Most likely to lead to an undershoot. Could possibly be a reversal here. Currently, it's a big trading range though. 20 EMA still can act as a some sort of support here. Gotta always be aware of the bull and bear case. Right, on some time frame it's bullish, and on other time frame it's bearish. It's always bullish and bearish at the same time. That's why the market, that's why trading is hard. It's always both and. Have you guys ever had your tick tickled? Huh? Do you guys even know what that feels like? Avalon says one too many times. <laughs> you make it sound like it's a... Uh... GC break not in a while. You guys are ridiculous. Always making it erotic. Always at the chance you can pause. You, you jump on the chance to make anything erotic. All right. I'm going to short here. I do not care. We're in pandas. We're going to redeem getting our tick tickled here. It could just be a big trading range, right? Five minute chart. It's actually in a big trading range. It hits the top and the bottom. You can come right back to the top here if we decide to stay as a trading range here. In this trap trade, thinking we're going to get a push down here because of the overshoot here. I'm thinking of undershoot here now. This is what I'm aiming for. Gotta get at least a one-to-one -one here, in my opinion. 
trade is not worth it unless I get a one to one. So I'll take the hit. I'd rather take the hit than not get my my price target here at this point. All right, does reverse. So it does do the overshoot to undershoot. Just undershoot is very small here. I'm still alive, pandas. I don't know how, but I'm still alive. Amazing. And I'm dead. <laughs> ah, there's two trades. Could just be a big trading range here. We did have the overshoot to the undershoot. But the undershoot is very small compared to the overshoot. Eh, not very small, but relatively smaller. <sighs> I'm getting bounced around here. I'm like a ping pong ball. Ping pong ball or pin ball? What's a better analogy? I feel like a ping pong ball or I feel like a pin ball. What's a better analogy? I need to know. Wow, bouncing right back up. I mean, this trading range could be it, pandas. This could be our edge today. This five minute trading range. I may take it again. I may try to go short at the top. I may go short at the top here, pandas. This could be our edge today. I'm gonna try. I think I'm in a good mood because I got 20 subs. That's 20, 20 subs, pandas. That means I got 20 more pandas join my family, adopted into this family. Pandas. The second entry long on the five minute could be strong. Could be real strong. It's actually a triangle here. Higher time frame is probably an OI pattern. Big up, big down. is happening right now Big up, big down, big up. It's like marquee trading range price action. Watch this, pandas. Check this out. Check this out right now. Crude oil. Ooh, crude oil sets a trap up. It's actually a trap on crude. Should I take a trade on crude? I've never done so. The gold is also in a trade range. Up here is gold, down here is crude. Oh, that's annoying. Maybe I can check a crude oil trade. Okay, the second entry on this trigger here. The five minute, check this out, Panas. Check this out. 
We're gonna bounce it back down to the bottom of the trading range. Just check this out. Watch. I get filled here. On crude. It's potential to go up here. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get filled here. I'll leave it alone. to the top of the trading range on the five minute chart is a question i think we might find our edge here in this trading range sell near the top buy near the bottom just keep rinse and repeat make a million daryl dollars We can't even get back to the top of the trading range on the five minute chart. It's so choppy right now. This is too choppy, Pandas. What can I say? Market went completely sideways after a just a ridiculous overnight session. I feel like the market's like exhausted and just wants to go sideways for the rest of the day. Right? Like the stamina of the market is just depleted if there's such thing. Got that overshoot to the undershoot. Coming back up to the top of this channel here. Okay. Ten thousand tick trap. Why? If it comes back to the bottom, why would I not buy the bottom here? Well, it's because we failed to reach to the top. So I'm not looking to buy here. It looks, it feels more bearish at that point. If we can't reach back to the top, showing that the bulls, right? If there's any evidence in here of the price action, if who is stronger, bulls or bears? If we can't get back to the top. Then it looks like the bears are stronger. Okay, got a second to short trigger in here. Interesting. Thoughts on BTC having? How about this, pandas? I have no idea what that means. Like, from my understanding, they're going to get rid of half of the Bitcoin. Does that mean that the price should double? You get rid of half the supply. I don't even know what that means. I don't know why it happens. What, what, can someone explain to me what is this BTC having? I mean, I should know it, but honestly, it, I, I have no clue what it is. We've got a trap trade here. This could actually make the market move. Could really fly here at this point. A failed trap, failed second entry short trap. I'm just thinking maybe we can find some edge here going short and long around this area. Going short around here, going long near the bottom. It's literally a limit order trade. I, I usually don't do these, but I'm gonna try. The reward for the miner becomes half at any having. Okay. Cool. Now, what does that mean? <laughs> it, it, does that mean that you need to try twice as hard to get the same amount of Bitcoin? To fight the inflation. What? Is if you can't throw more confusing words to explain a simpler word, right? That doesn't make sense.
Does that mean less people will mine or more people will mine? Or does that mean the same amount of people will mine, but they'll just get less Bitcoin? I heard Bitcoin is supposed to rise like gold, right? Like, I think there's something along those lines. Like, they're trying to mimic gold. That's where the Bitcoin, like, formula was made. Like, the, the rate of Bitcoin being found is, like, supposed to mimic gold. That's what I believe. Trap. I mean, gold is, is flying. Gold is actually flying. Please don't break my chart. Oh, my chart's broken. No. Oh. Okay, it's not that bad. Yeah, like gold is actually flying. Making new all-time highs. I'm scared. I'm not gonna do anything. I don't want my, my charts to break. Market's absolutely doing nothing right now, Pandas. This five minute bar basically broke the bottom, broke the top, and now it's coming back to the bottom. It's actually insane. What just happened with this one bar? All right, it's just it's just trading range price action, Pandas. Have profits, so less miners. <sighs> What do I think about it? Well, if there's less miners, then I guess less Bitcoin. Does that change the, the desirability of Bitcoin? Because if you know anything about economics, Bitcoin, I mean, everything, the value or uh, let's say not the value, the cost of everything is based on supply and demand. So <clears throat> if you have Let's just say all of a sudden the demand for Bitcoin disappears. It, it's going to be worth nothing. It's going to cost nothing. You can say that with any fiat currency, blah, 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 blah. But at the end, at the end. Okay, I'm not going to lie. I don't have any Bitcoin. So I, I'm not, I'm like, maybe I'm more leaning towards like not caring about Bitcoin because I don't have any. I think people typically who don't have Bitcoin like the trash Bitcoin because they're all sad they didn't get on the boat at the right time. But to me, I still find it hard to want to buy Bitcoin. It's just like, I don't think it's a good store for, store of value. You just have no idea. Like if you really want to put your life savings into it, I feel like that's that's a hard thing for me to do. Whereas I feel like something like gold is like a little more stable. Even though it's like basically rocketing right now, it's still historically more stable. I don't know if that makes any difference. I mean, at the end, all you need are Daryl dollars, so who cares? We just want Daryl dollars. Just absolutely doing nothing right now, Pandas. We are just staring at a dead market. It's absolutely deceased. This market is straight up deceased right now, and uh, there's nothing we can do. Five minute trap. Okay, pushing up, strong bull bar potentially here. It's a big triangle though, if you look at the five minute chart, we're still in this triangle, this triangular formation. Very apparent in my opinion right now. These points need to touch perfectly or else you might lose money. Technically, it's not actually touching perfectly here. You see how I adjusted it? Now these points aren't touching at the end here. See, it's a big no-no. You gotta, yeah, they have to touch or you suck at trading. There it is. It's crossing a little bit, but just, you know, let it go. Just let it go. What is going on, pandas? I'm about to do a giveaway soon. I'm about to do a giveaway.
A recent study showed Bitcoin size is inversely related to the quantity and quality of the holder's friends. Inverse, so the higher it goes, the less friends they have. I thought the higher it goes, the more friends they have. Or is it like the friends are so jealous they don't want to be friends with them anymore? No, I think people are more greedy than that. If you have a friend that you know has a lot of Bitcoin, you want to like become friends with them. So you may not get the Bitcoin yourself, but you'll indirectly benefit from that Bitcoin. You know what I mean? What is the lifetime cost of 150k PA? Um, like 270 or something like that. I think. Pandas, I'm bye bye money. Thanks for joining everyone. It's 50 50 on ping pong ball and pinball. I got it. I got gotcha. you. This market's absolutely going sideways right now. It's crazy. We stream here live every single day, 9 a.m. Eastern Time. Thanks for joining. Just ain't right. Love these emojis. They're my panda emojis. Made by yours truly. Pandas. Thanks for joining everyone. We trade here. The two-legged pullback. We trade here pure price action. And right now, pandas, we're down $362. It's all good. You know why it's all good, pandas? Because right now we have BBM. Code BBM for 80% off. Apex evals. That's just like... A Twinkie wrapper and a stick of gum. That's the price of that. Just to get funded. It'll cost you only about $30 for the eval. $85 for the PA account fee. All in about $110, Pandas. $110 you can be funded over $2,000. Essentially, with that drawdown. Pandas, risk-free trading here. Trap. Virtually. OI pattern, Pandas. <sighs> I mean, it's it's a dumb one. I'll do it. Whatever. I'll do it. I'll just do it. I'll do it. Got an OI panda. We got no other setup here right now, pandas. It's all we got. This is all we got. The OI pattern here. OI patterns. You should go for one to ones on these. On well, super choppy days like this, OI patterns are actually not that good. Because they just end up chopping a lot. But it's all I have right now, Pan. It's all we got. Maybe Trap Trade might be worth taking here. I don't know. I should have scalped it. I could scalp three points. One, two, three. And I could scalp three points. Let's see if we get a trap trade here. Then we can actually move our stop loss here for a smaller stop loss. And then work off this. This one to one here. Our break even is right here. I mean, we could take off a risk if we want. Let's see how low it can go. How low can you go? How low can you go? Ooh, I may have to just take the full risk here. I may just have to take the full risk here, Pandas. Because otherwise, it's not enough. It's not enough. It does reverse a little bit here. It does kind of suck. I'll tell you that much. I mean, we could still be in a trading range. Plain and simple. Bouncing off the bottom of the triangle here. Let's 
This could hurt. I think this is appropriate risk. I don't mind it. It's about $200 risk for good reward here. I think I'll just hold on to it. Let's see what happens. Pushing back down. Oof. Target filled. I'll just take it. I'll take a small bamboo. I didn't like. I didn't like the wiggles. I didn't like the wiggles. And my paper cojones fail me once again. Where I'll be deep. I'll be deep in the green right now if I just held on to that. I didn't like the wiggles, pandas. I didn't like the wiggles, but I don't know, you pay for the price. That's the price you pay for having weak cojones. I'm telling you, in this game, you need to have very strong cojones. I made a little teeny bamboo pandas. I made a little teeny bamboo. I'll take it. I'll take it. I didn't like the, I didn't like the wiggles. I didn't like the wiggles. What can I say? But it would have been a decent trade to take. It would have been a decent trade to take. Why did I have to reverse here? I have no idea. I have no clue why I needed to do that at least one time. It shook, it shook me out, pandas. Pandas, it shook me out. I'll admit it. I'll admit it. It shook me out. Oh, I'll admit it. My cojones are all shriveled up right now. I'll admit that. Couldn't hold on to it, pandas. The grip was too weak. The grip was just too weak on that one. We let it go. We move on. The five minute actually creates the one to one, right? Like I mentioned, this trade. These are one to one trades. And it makes a one to one and bounces off of it. Oof. I hate the fact it had to reverse one time and then go back down and it might have reversed again. It just. Ah, pandas! I can't hold on to any of my trades right now. Can't hold on to my winners. I still made a little bamboo on that, so it's all good, but still, pandas, I'm just. When I say little, I mean like we made like less than a point on that. I typically take Big Mamas here, but because we're so choppy, I'm going to skip Big Mama here. Because we're so choppy. We let it go. I think it's I think it's okay to let it go. Unless we get a trap trade on the 10,000 tick, then I'll 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 gladly take the trade on 10,000 tick trap trade. But unless we get that set up, I'm going to skip this Big Mama. Big Mama triggers. Could be easy scout, but I gotta I gotta trade the current price action, which is very choppy, very sideways. Lots of outside bars, lots of wicks, lots of candles. So when Big Mama triggers, I'm just very uncertain. I have no idea. I'll take uh, the trap on the 10,000 tick if we get it. My 10,000 tick, it might be setting up for a trap trade here. It's a failed second entry loan. Oops. It's actually right here. It's very small, but A, B, C. Right, triggers a second entry long, but then reverses. Maybe I'll consider it as a trap trade, but if this trading range lasts, I mean, this second entry long could just come back up to the top of the trading range as well, so. It depends on what your bias is right now. <sighs> right, you already failed this big mama here. One. One, two. Right, you fail it perfectly at five points. You already failed that big mama. I'll take this trap trade, but I think that's it, right? Because the second entry long is hard to take here. Even though you are finding yourselves in a trading range, it's, take, it's hard to take because you're underneath 20 EMA, so you just don't know at this point. It's very difficult. It's 
second attempt on Big Mama here. I could take the second attempt. I could. I could try. But I'll skip it. Skip it. Skipping it. It's all good, Pandas. We'll move on. Next. We can always take Big Mamas, right? Every day almost has a Big Mama. We're going to skip this one. Yeah, it works out. Big Mama does work out the second time. I was waiting for... I was being patient. I wanted a 10,000 tick trap to trigger before taking that trade, but the second attempt on Big Mama does work out. We're down 295. Hey, it's all good, pandas. I think I'm more upset that I didn't hold that trade. I just could not hold it. My hands were shaking. My hands were shaking. My paws were shaking. I don't have hands. I have paws. My paws were shaking. I just could not hold. It did this little reversal here, and then it started to give me lots of wiggles here. And I said, eh, if it allows me to come out break even, I'll just do it. And uh, instead, it just... Um, actually goes the way I thought it was going to go. It's actually pushing kind of hard down now. Interesting. So that means that this trap on the 5 minute might have been a good trap to take. Unfortunately, right when you take it, it um, reversed up and then it came back down. So it is what it is. This inside bar was good to take, which is what I was in. Unfortunately, it didn't make much bamboo off of that. I wasn't expecting, you know, I was expecting more chop here, but now... The price action is kind of telling us, you know, we may be coming out of this trading range now and we may find a direction. We might start finding a trend here. It could be possible. 2000 tick chart, man. This is very choppy. I don't think these are trends are very strong. I don't know. It's very cons consistent, but it's not very strong. Ten thousand tick trap. Now we're wedged between the 20 EMA and the 240 SMA. Trap maybe on the 10K chart. <clears throat> it's tough. Tough, 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 in my opinion. Tough, tough, tough. Yo, wow. Not next week, but the week after. We got some crazy news. That's some crazy news happening. Almost every single day there's news. Almost. Not Monday, but Tuesday's big news. Wednesday's big news. Thursday's big news. Friday's big news. Jeez. Is it witching? Too? I don't think so. It could be a couple witchings. I mean, it's kind of hard to find witchings because, like, options now are every day, right? Zero DTE. 
So the witching is not as like big, but maybe. We do got a fail second entry long here. <clears throat> I'll attempt it. Possibly last trade of the stream. I don't want an outside bar though. I do not want an outside bar reversal. I do not want that. Another thing, the 2000 tick chart is very choppy, right? So. Even the 10,000 tick chart is giving itself a, a decent setup here. Yeah, I think I have to try this. I have to try. I gotta try. I have to try here. I have to try. In this trade. Possibly last trade of the stream. I gotta try. At least a one to one here. I think that'll get us right at like break even essentially today. If we get the one to one on this trade. This trap trade here. On the 10,000 tickets, actually a really nice trade. Really nice setup. From how everything looks like. Big push up. Break a trend, new high. Bouncing off that, that resistance here. We need at least a one to one to make this trade worth it. Couldn't get four points even. I want at least five points. Give me at least, at least five strong bear bar any nearest low on the five minute chart. Good sign for us. Most likely follow through. <laughs> Pandas. <laughs> Almost. Almost. Almost pandas. <laughs> Almost got it. We're getting close. Give me that six point move. Give me that one to one. Make this trade worth it for me. Please make this trade worth it for me. Come to Papa. One more push down. One more push down. All right, 2000 tick chart. One more push down. Lower or high here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. A new low. Break the low. It's such a high chance now. We broke that low. Such a high chance to get it. What? Target. Let's go. Pandas. You thought I was going to end red today. How many of you guys thought I was going to end red today? That's what you thought. But little did you know, I'm a lucky panda. That trap trade pandas was beautiful. I could not resist that trap trade. Even though the risk was six points, I felt like we can make six points here. And that's exactly what we just did. And pandas, yours truly is green, $12.42, which means I can order one Chipotle burrito, but with four accounts copied, I can order four Chipotle burritos pandas. With steak, double meat. I actually don't know if that's true. That might actually Chipotle might be more expensive than that now, but that's what I feel like. Pandas, we did it. We did it. Who? The Ric Flair. Who? Pandas. I mean, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. That trap trade pandas. 
That trap trade, I'm telling you, those traps. When you get them, they they are good. They are a good setup. Very good setup. And essentially, that's what I was waiting for for Big Mama. But I mean, I got it anyways. I got it anyways. It's all good. Big move down on the five minute charts, just melting now. I mean, we could be in strong downtrend day. It could just be it's just just a simple downtrend day today. Multiple bear bars, five minute chart. Panda, think about the two contracts you exited prematurely. 15 points in profit. Now, why would you remind me of that? <laughs> why would you remind me of that at such a time as this when I'm celebrating? You know? I, you know, there's a time for everything. That is... Why would you do that? You know, I like to think of the good things that are happening. Not the bad things. Let's just focus on the good pandas. And right now, the good is we are green. Hey, green is green pandas, and I'll take it. 10,000 tick take trap. It. Take it. Lee AA likes going for that one to one. If I just stayed out of that chop, right, out of all that nonsense, if I just stayed away from like all of this trading here and then just focus on like the good setup right here outside of that chop, I would have been fine. Pandas, look at that. One to one made and that's reversing. It's actually crazy. Coming right back up. It's a trap trade, maybe, but strong bull bar. Double top here, quite possibly. We right, gotta break a trend to new low here as well. The markers disappeared. Let's see if we can make a trade here. I just want two points. Give me two points. Going for two points. I'm gonna risk two points. I might need to do more than that, but it is what it is. Oof, might get hit here. All right, it's all good. We're down a little bit, pandas. It's all good. We're down just a little bit. We had a trap trade there potentially. Oh, yes, you're okay. All right, let me try like this. Back to like this. Like it is. All right. Trap fails. Could be a double top here. Right, double top here, could keep pushing down. Lee eight. Two trades today, up six ten. Let's go. 
That's all that matters. Green is green. Okay, lower high here. Still above the 20 May though. I'm gonna try to take one more trade today. I mean, we're still, you know, it's not even 10.45 yet, but let's see if we can get one more trade in here. I still think we have more room to go down. I don't know if I want to take this short here though. Back up. Interesting. Nah, I'll stay. I'll stay. I'm going to be a good little panda. Stick to the plan. I kind of want to go short there. Looking for a new low here. Do we want to do high first? Push up. Mm -hmm. Might have missed a chance here. Quite possibly. Okay. Okay. Is that going long? Pandas. It's like actually long here. Decent signal bar. Risk is quite large though. One, two, three, about four points of risk. On the 2000 tick chart, it's kind of overlapping, a little bit choppy here. Hmm. The question is, we want a new high after this big push up here. Makes sense to look for one more high. Kind of makes sense. Kind of does, kind of doesn't. What do I do here? Am I trying to go short? Am I looking for a new low? 10,000 tick chart looks like it wants one more low. 10,000 tick chart looks like it just bounced off perfectly off the 20 MA. A nice looking signal bar. It looks like it wants to make one more low here. So it looks like pandas. I'll take the trap trade here on the 2,000 tick. Pandas, can I get it? One time, can I get the fail second entry long? 2,000 tick chart. Stay patient, pandas. Patience pays. Good things come to those who wait. But for not those, but not for those who wait too late, pandas. Let's get it. Let's get it, pandas. I don't want the outside bar reverse. I may take it here, though. I like it that much. Looking for that new low here. Looking for that new low. Risk is not that big. One, two, three. Okay, pushing back up here. Trying to play mind games with me right now. It's not gonna work though. It's not gonna work. I'll tell you that much. It will not work. Mm, micro double top, interesting. Ooh, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Right, it kind of shows that bulls are kind of here, eager to buy the clothes here. Interesting, pandas. What do we do here? Huh. Oh! Get me in here. Alright, I'm in. New low? I'm trying to look for that new low. We're risking about two and a half points to gain one two three four points i think it's worth trap trade here this is not too big micro double top got a little retracement on that trade so it looks okay Ooh. i 
think we might have made the right choice here, pandas. I think we might have made the right choice here. Rarely does it look like this and it doesn't create a new low. Rarely does it do that. I will not let this shake me out like I got shooken up here. I got shook out up here. I'm not going to get shaken out here, pandas. If I lose this, I lose it and we move on. Another reason why I kind of prematurely exited that other one is because I was in two contracts. And I hate being in two contracts on 50k accounts. 50k accounts being in two contracts is like certain death. It's actually certain death. Okay, we're peeping down here. Cracking down, cracking down. Cracking down! Huh? 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 One tick? No. 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 Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare do that again to me. Alright, I'm coming. I'm, 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 I gotta make some bamboo here. No! I gotta make some bamboo here. Don't you dare. Target Get me out of there. Alright, pandas. I'll take it. I'll take it. I didn't want to get tick shot again. I didn't want my tick tickled. I did not want the market to tickle my tick once again because it already happened. I don't think I can handle it two times in a row. Right? My tick was already tickled. I didn't want that to happen again. I just secured, you know, one, two and a half points. Basically, one to one risk reward. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'm up a little bit. Just a little bit of green, pandas. I'll take it, though. Just a little bit of green. Whoo, pandas. I mean, why does it need to tickle my tick? And notice, pandas, where it tickled my tick up here was an actual perfect reversal. That's where it perfectly reversed, pandas. I entered long here. It tickled my tick, and that's where the highest point, that's the high of day today. Incredible, pandas. Incredible. It tickled my tick, and it reversed. Goodness gracious, pandas, what do I do? It was about to tickle my tick again here, but I said, uh-uh, give me some bamboo. I just took a little bamboo this time. I just took what I could. I don't think I could handle another another tickling tickle of my tick. It's too much on the mental cap. But good thing it's Friday, right, pandas? We can restore that mental capital this weekend. Do the things we enjoy and love. We did a whole lot of trading, but got a whole lot of nothing today. Very tricky day. Rarely does it look like this, pandas. I'll say that much. Rarely does it look like this and not make a new low. In fact, it does make a new low, but one tick. I think rarely it, it makes this pattern and doesn't push down kind of hard. This is like a very strong pattern in my opinion, right? It's basically, I don't know. It's like an H pattern. I don't know what to call it really, but it just pushes down, pull back, and then pushes down. Very rarely does it do this without actually pushing down pretty hard beneath the previous pivot level. We did, right? We did stab it just a little bit. But I think there's more to come here, Pandas. And if we get a second entry short, I think I'm interested. Give me a second entry short. I'm interested. I'm in, Pandas. Give me that second entry short, though. Then I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it, Pandas. I'm doing it. Give me that second entry short, and I'll do it. Take it, I'll take it. I'll do it and I'll take it. Second just short, almost setting up here. Oh, I'm about to do it. I'm about to take it. Let's do it. Let's just do it. Second just short here. Thoughts and prayers, pandas, because you know this is how you get chopped up when you're so, so, so confident in a trade. That is the best time. You know you're going to get trapped and chopped. You know you're going to get trapped and chopped here. When you're that confident in a trade. It's a terrible signal bar. So it's actually a good thing for me. It makes a decision easy to skip it. You know. That's kind of a nice thing right. When you know what you need to do in a trade. That's kind of nice. Even though it makes it you not enter the trade. At least it's nice. You know. Every once in a while to be absolutely certain what you should do. Which is like if this is a strong bull bar. You're just absolutely certain you don't enter in short. I'm scared. 
skipping it, right? It's a bad signal bar. Skip it. Move on to the next trade. Let's see if we can get something better. Could be a double bottom here. Could quite possibly be. The five minute chart is showing itself to be very choppy, right? Strong bear bar. Absolutely no fall through. Reversal here, right? Bear trap. Bears see this, they enter short here. Now they're trapped in this strong bull bar. Most likely they're gonna try to sell to try to come up break even some point in time today. But I don't know. This one's tough, pandas. This one's tough. This one's tough. Very rarely does it look like this, right? 10,000 tick chart. Just like hanging out underneath the 20 may like this strong push down small pullback very rarely does it like not have another push down here in my opinion maybe not very rarely but just like very um very common for this to just push down again now if we get above the 20 may that's a different whole another, another story right if we're strong close above the 20 may it could be a double bottom at the end of it all which is what we might be getting here, pandas, actually. A double bottom instead. Jeez. Pandas, don't forget to use BBM. Um, the code ends on the 30th, so you still have like about a week left to use it. But uh, Pandas, make sure you take advantage of it though while it lasts. And also, just remember you have it. So you're saving money when you're buying those Apex evals. So you can trade that, those Daryl dollars. Pandas, I'll see you guys bright and early tomorrow. I think that's it for me. I'm not sure much can go on from here. But Pandas, have an amazing weekend, everyone. Thanks for joining. Thanks for engaging. Thanks for the 20 subs, Gilbert. Hope you guys enjoyed the, the show. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Hope you guys made some bamboo, made more than me. Even though I'm, I'm green, but I hope you guys made more than me. So pandas, have an amazing weekend. And as always, pandas, happy trading. God bless. Bye. Bye.